I created my own character. It was Christine de Rohan. Uh, she was a French noble. It was my first LARP, so I wanted uh, my character to be not really complicated. But it turned out that some other of my family members had really big secrets and dealing with that was a very big challenge. I managed to have fun of all this because even though I'm not an actress, being immersed in all this reality that I was a noble, there was servants, there was my family, even though they were actually people who I saw for the first time. Somehow I felt like at home. I didn't feel any that is in, in natural, unnatural for me. It was quite a surprise. Life as a noble, well, you can say that there are many activities you can attend. We had uh, many small talks with other nobles. It might be boring when you're actually in the situation that it is your life, but when you're acting that it's, it's not true. It's much more funny when you're trying to talk to some person you see for the first time and pretend that uh, it's some distant member of your family and that you should ask about oh, her daughter or what is, what's going on, how are, you, how are you doing. It was quite fun and I think that I can learn very much from this experience and apply it to a real life when I would be in such a situation. When you can, in a LARP, become a different person uh, for a while or for a few days, I think you can discover a different point of view. I choose to be a noble because I think being a noble is much easier than being a servant in such a castle. I admire those who chose the role to play servants because uh, you should change your mind completely to submit yourself to serve other people when in these times we are not used to it. <laughs>